Welcome back to The Perspective. I'm Florence Armin. I'm still talking to Grace Walia, Miss India Indonesia 2015 and the country manager for Miss India Indonesia, Shanti Tolani. Now, what was the first thing that the two of you did when you landed in Mumbai? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, the first thing we did was made sure that we get checked in and we get yes. settled. <laughs> we settled into our rooms. We sort of took it in that we're in Mumbai and we're going to, and that I'm going to represent a country and that I'm about to meet a lot of girls. And I was with one of the contestants actually that mm -hmm. night. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, that was the first thing. It's a bit different for me because I think. Um, See, as a part of a contestant, you're really excited to meet the young girls, yeah, right? Yeah, your competitors. Yeah, yeah. You, as, an, as a contestant, you want to know what your competition is yeah. like, right? So there's a lot of fun when you get to know the girls. Initially, it's mm -hmm. fun. Mm -hmm. Later on, it becomes a bit more... <laughs> 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 but uh, from an organizer's point of view, I think we're more observant about the whole pageant, you know? Mm -hmm. And because we are so aware of our girl, we're sort of like watching the other people as well and, and mm -hmm. thinking whether we will be able to get the crown back to Indonesia or not. Mm -hmm. So I think there's a lot of thought process that goes on and I think I observe a lot when I'm there. Mm -hmm. So it's different. So Definitely observe. So. 40, uh, 40 other countries, yes. I understand, uh, yes. that, you were f that you were actually uh, running against, uh, yeah. uh, Grace. And what, what part of Indonesia did you represent while you were there? Um, the whole in of Indonesia. Okay. Yeah, when I was there, um, I really communicated with a lot of the girls about uh, Indonesia and just the whole of it, not just Jakarta, where I'm mm -hmm. from. I talked about all the <coughs> other islands, mm -hmm. uh, like the popular vacation island, mm -hmm. which is Bali. Mm -hmm. And I talked about um, all the temples that are there, like mm -hmm. Tandu Borobudur, mm -hmm. and yeah, the whole of Indonesia. Mm -hmm. And uh, tell us your journey there, uh, Shanti and Grace. Uh, once you land there, how, how long were you in uh, Mumbai for? It was a total of eight days. It was mm -hmm. a total of eight days. And um, the contestants uh, went through a lot of training and grooming because now you're, you're quarantined. You're all 40 of you in, under yes. one roof. So they went through a lot of intensive, very, very in intensive training from their choreography to their public speaking to their ramp walk. and. What we experienced in Miss Indonesia for two months, it was packed into a week <laughs> in oh, Mumbai. It was so, <laughs> yeah. so it was intense. So it was incredibly intense, but it was incredibly exciting as mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. How many mentors did you have when uh, for for the Mumbai? Pageant? We had uh, two, mm -hmm. uh, where Elisa and uh, Sandeep, um, Alicia taught us ramp walking and mm -hmm. how to walk mm -hmm. uh, with confidence, and mm -hmm. Sandeep taught us choreography for the final day. Mm -hmm. No, uh, Shanti, uh, well, she was busy trying to take good care of you and also the pageant. She <laughs> yeah. was also busy spreading news to Indonesia. Hey, this is what's happening. Yes. She keeps us up, updated with yes. the photos of your um, activities. Yes. So what was the most exciting moment? You, Indonesia, like you said, two yes. months with uh, 19 other girls and now it's 40, around 40 other yes, yes. Uh, girls from, from different countries yes. in eight days. Yes. What was that like? It was uh, indescribable. Mm -hmm. We. Uh, for a week, we woke up in the morning, we had breakfast together, and then we head on to training. Mm -hmm. It was um, incredible, actually, because we actually uh, got our uniforms. It had Miss India Worldwide on it, and yeah. that was incredibly exciting. We had our also pink shirts. Also a proud shirts. moment, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think the proud moment is when they're presented uh, with their with country sash mm -hmm. on the first mm -hmm. night. On so the there's a gala night. dinner, and they're yeah. presented, and they're, you know, uh, they're mm -hmm. presented with the country that they're mm -hmm. representing. Mm -hmm. And I think that, that just the presentation of Indonesia on the sash. That was a memorable moment for me <laughs> to wear to Indonesia yes. around me. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. And uh, Shanti, what, 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 can, what were you able to learn from such or a huge organization, Miss uh, India Worldwide, that you could bring back? And oh, of course, uh, your goal will always to uh, grow Miss India Indonesia, make it better every year. Every year, yes, absolutely. I think I'm very, as, a, as an organization, we are really very new. It is mm -hmm. our third year mm -hmm. for Miss India Indonesia under our organization. And when we, when we interact with national directors and country managers from other countries, they've been there for a long time. Some of them eight, have been there since eight years, 10 yeah. years, 12 years. Yeah. Some of them over about, you know, 20 years. Yeah. So. One aspect is, of course, making sure she does a great job and, I'm, and, and we're there for her in case she sort of feels a bit, you know, yeah. lost. But on the other hand, we learn a lot from other national directors. Yeah. We learn a lot about, about how they deal with the pageant in their countries. Yeah. 
how supportive their countries have been towards their organization, yeah. how they deal with a lot of um, a lot of you know sudden situations yeah. that happen in their countries because everything is un unexpected. Yeah. And dealing with young girls, young minds, young emotions, it's pretty challenging. And when we talk about it, because here in Indonesia, for example, this year we dealt with 20 girls, 20 contestants, 20 different personalities, 20 different reactions, you know. And we learn a lot because I feel I'm, I'm relatively new. And we have to be there. We have to be there for all 20 of them. So we learn a lot about dealing with young girls. We learn a lot about dealing with the pageant, technical stuff and how to get better with, with time. So it's really helpful. Some of them don't want to share the experiences, most of them do. <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get back to Mumbai and you being crowned as one of the uh, subtitles, subtitles okay, yes. from Miss India Worldwide 2015 when we come back.